Good morning, everybody. So this morning I have been yard sailing and I had one specific thing in mind that I was looking for and um, I found it. And it is a, let me get here, it's heavy, a submersible pump. And I picked this up for, I think it was around $5. I bought this and another uh, big old plant of herbs and stuff. <clears throat> Paid $24 for everything and uh, put it this way, he had $20 marked on the plant because it was huge and this really nice pot. Um, so I got both for $24. I'll show you guys that later when I get back to the house. But so what I want to do with this is be able to take and utilize all of the water that I have right there on the canal behind me at the tiny house to water my plants without me playing the whole Jack and Jill thing and going up and down the hill with my pail. <clears throat> now I am on my way to go to Ace Hardware where I'm going to try and find some fittings that will go on this end here and then get a hose. This is my plan. I don't know if it's gonna work or uh, yeah, if it'll, if I'll be able to make it happen, but I think it, I think I will. And um, yeah, so let's see. So we're back and um, Benny is anticipating going to check on the babies. <laughs> you ready to go see the babies? Make sure they're okay? Yeah? Let's go see the babies. <laughs> Benny! Well, hi, Benny. You find the babies? Yeah. Hi, babies. <laughs> All right, so I think I have a little flower pot over here that, that might fit the pump. Oh, and here are those plants that I was talking about that I got from the yard sale with the pump. Isn't that awesome? I got some parsley, lavender, uh, mint and over here is some uh, what is that called I forget rosemary it's rosemary okay all right let's find this flower pot this I don't know it might be too small hopefully it's just right It's too small. What are we gonna do, Benny? Let's see what else we got. All I have is that, and I don't wanna poke holes in it because that's where the duckies swim. Good grief, I do not wanna go back to the store again. There's gotta be something here I can use. I suppose I could use this tin bucket over here and just put it in deep enough so the water's going over it. I won't have to put holes in it. Oh no, the babies are trying to come. Go up there, Bentley. Down there is the best spot to put it, but it's on the opposite side. This is where I come down with my pail of water because there's a little step I can step down to get to the water. But that's kind of towards the other end. I need to go down there where the... Uh, secret garden is so I want it to be over here more so I don't have to stretch that hose very far but there's this huge drop off and this water is down so far right now it's usually up another two or three feet it's crazy oh my goodness babies what are you doing you shouldn't be down here there's scary stuff down here you watch them, Bentley. You think you're going swimming? This is your swimming bucket. Aww. I'll find something else, but we gotta use this for right now. Oh no, Benny! The baby's stuck! Okay, okay, okay. Okay, I'll help. It's okay, I get, I help, I help. There you go! Oh. 
Let's go up here where you're safer. Babies, come on, babies. Bentley, come on, they'll follow you. Come on. All right. Now you guys gotta stay up here. I got some work to do. Now later on, I will be putting uh, pipe glue and some Teflon tape around the threaded part, but for now, I just wanna see if this is gonna work. All right, so I just realized that the part um, for the, the hose connector at the top is the wrong end. I wanna hook this part to the pump so I will be able to attach this to the other end of the hose, but I, he gave me the female part instead of the male part. So I'm just gonna turn the hose around for now um, and see if it works this way. Later on, I'll go back at the other part so I can put the nozzle on the end. All right, so now that I got all the kinks out of this 75 foot of hose that I bought, let's go and plug in the jackery and see if she works. Alright, so we're gonna plug it here. Oh, shit. We got gators that are around here, so any little splash makes me nervous. Alright, so let's turn it on. Seventy-three watts. Come on, you can do it. No. No. We're not going to do it. Giving up on me. Eighty five watts. She ain't enough to do it. All right. Well, that sucks big time. So this is the Jackery 240, by the way. So I do have the EcoFlow 288. So let's give that a go. Right, Eco Flow, don't let me down. This is your time to shine. Show Jackery what's up. Alright, so we got it plugged in. Let's turn her on. Oh! Oh, snap! Let's see how many watts it's pulling. Holy shit! 520 output watts. No wonder the Jackery wouldn't do it. 
So as you could see, the pump is just way too strong and I need to go get the pipe glue so I can see if it's actually gonna be able to be strong enough to push it up this hill right here. So I guess I'm going back to the store and while I'm there, I might as well get the correct fitting that I need as well. Oh, well ain't this nice. All right, well, now that it's done pouring, let's go get these plants watered. You guys, this is getting to be super frustrating. Not only have I been driving over all over God's green earth to pick up every little part or go back to the store, I don't know how many times because I had the wrong part and then, you know, I get here and I can't open this damn can of cement. I don't know, I think somebody possibly cemented the lid on, I don't know. I tried pliers, I can't get it. Definitely can't get it with my woman's strength. And um, yeah, it poured down rain. So I don't even know what the fuck I'm doing at this point. Well, at least the sun is starting to come out now. All I want to do is see if this will work. All right, so I YouTubed how to get this open and showed using a little flathead screwdriver. So I don't have one of those, but let's try that. Oh, snap. Please work. Oh my god, yes! Alright, so I got that side all set up. Now I'm going to go put this on the other end since I got the right fitting. And then we're going to turn it on. I'm going to flip this so it'll be wide open because I don't know if it's going to put too much pressure on it with it closed. All right, boys and girls, it's the moment of truth. Let's turn this on. Oh, it's running. Let's go, let's go. Do we have water? I don't see anything yet. Got to prime it, maybe. How fucking exciting is that? How freaking exciting is that? Oh my god, I'm out of breath. This is great. Yeah, buddy. Come on now. Woo! All right. Yeah! Man, I am out of breath running up and down this hill, but you guys, that is a game changer. I'm so excited about that. Now, hopefully, whoo, I can't breathe. That's gonna help me out so much to keep all these plants and all the fruits and vegetables I uh, planted as well alive through this intense heat without me going up and down this hill a million times with my bucket. So anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching and uh, thank you EcoFlow for coming through um, with the power needed to make this happen. Until next time, guys. Peace.